Shaw Magomedov versus Armin Petrosian is happening. Now, who's going to win this fight? Well, before we talk about who's going to win this fight, let's take a look at their latest performances. And when Shaw Magomedov fought Antonio Trocoli, and when Shaw Magomedov landed some great shots and kicks, took control of the whole entire fight, Shaw then put a lot of punishment on Antonio Trocoli and was directly enough to stop the fight in round three. Trocoli might get stopped on the feet here. That did Shara Magomedov went on to fight Mihal Olesheychuk and when Shara completely outlanded Mihal Olesheychuk won every single round and obviously Shara Magomedov ended up taking it by decision and still undefeated Shara Let's take a look at Armand's latest performances in which he fought Christian Duncan in which both stars are very fast both went back and forth both of the striking was great but Armand ended up taking it by decision Armand Superman At this, Armin went to fight Adolfo Vieira, in which Adolfo got him in an arm triangle choke and made him tap in round one. Now, once again, the UFC matchmakers have cooked with this match because this is a very evenly matched fight and both men are great strikers. So style-wise, it's going to be a really good fight since both men only look forward to striking and never go for takedowns. They just plan on staying busy on the feet, throwing a bunch of kicks and a bunch of punches. And we know this because if we take a look at both men's record, well, Shara Magomedov stands with a record of 14 wins with 11 of those wins coming by knockout and he has no wins by submission and he's undefeated. And if you look at Armin Petrosian, well, he stands with the record of nine wins with six of those wins come by knockout and he also has no wins by submission and he has three losses so now how's this fight gonna go and who's gonna win this fight well, like i said both men are elite strikers not to mention that size wise it's pretty even as well since shara stands at six foot two and armin stands at six foot three so in this fight both men are definitely gonna have a lot of output they're gonna be throwing a bunch of kicks so the rounds are gonna be very hard to judge but my prediction is that if this fight was to go all round shara will most likely take it because again he has a lot of high output and in all of his ufc fights even in his hardest most like the one against Mihal lashesha we see that he always does enough to convincingly get the win but if somebody was to get stopped and get knocked out in this fight i believe that will have to be Charles, since we have seen multiple times throughout his career that he doesn't have the best defense as he does get hit a lot and since armand petrosian does seem to have the better boxing skills i do believe that he'll be the more dangerous guy when it comes to letting the hands go so in that case armand petrosian does take the win